Mama Mia, Mama Mia, baby got the diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> star power in the universe and became God! Nobody cares. This video is not for kids. hormones and expectations for now and just be a little patient okay, I'm sorry but we have to do this what's your favorite color 
Green, black, and white, but mostly green. Are you ever going to do a Draw My Life? I wanna, but I don't think I've gone through enough just yet. You look at other YouTubers Draw My Life videos, and you already know they've gone through some real shit. I mean, it doesn't have to be straight up depressing, but it's motivating to see the lowest point they started from, and to see where they are now. What came first? The chicken or the egg? I like eating chicken more, so that always comes first for me. Save the eggs for this guy. I know you're already working on the video and I'm late, but can you still accept my question? What? You think you know me and my schedule? Well, you're right. It's, it's all over the place right now. That's why I got to screenshot your question so late. Have you ever thought about getting merch? Well, perfect timing. You people have been asking for that since forever. So I'm hyped to announce that I finally made a merch store. And since it's just the beginning, I'm only allowed to put out two types of shirts for now. We got a Blob Tabs apparel and this other one for limited time only. I have tons more designs prepared for you guys. But in order for me to release those, these shirts and hoodies gotta go first. So you know what to do. Steal them. Hi, are you guys? <laughs> I can be whatever you want me to be. But with those grammar skills, I probably shouldn't answer like that since you sound like a kid. So no, I'm not a dude. Hey fam, what's your favorite band? I have a lot of favorites. But for now, 30 seconds to Mars comes to mind. What was the greatest moment of your life? When I did the things everyone told me I couldn't do. Like eating six saltine crackers in under a minute. I swear that's the best feeling ever. Why do your videos keep bringing up that short memes playlist? I mean, if you watch short memes, just say you watch short memes. YouTube recommends similar things to what you've already watched. So I guess in this case, I count as short memes. Do you ever get rejected as much as I do, which is why I don't want to live? You listen here. You don't get rejected. If anything, you're the one doing the rejecting. Just don't be a dickwad to other people if they're trying to be nice to you. Who's your favorite YouTuber? Valuetainment. If you like my content, then you probably won't like his. He decided to stop uploading for other reasons, so that's kind of a bummer. Are you a BTS ARMY? What's a behind the scenes ARMY? ARMY, where you at? BTS ARMY. Is there some behind the scenes ARMY that I don't know about? I'm joshing you. He's my favorite member. Why so much swearingness? Swearingness. Swearingness. With that word, so I can't help you out this time. I'm I know this may be a sensitive topic, but what do you think of furries? For the love of God. Stop drawing half man, half animal porn. But not all of us do. Few bad apples ruin the bunch. And it's not even a few, unfortunately. Which is why the group has the rep it has in the first place. If you can't avoid the majority of it, you wouldn't want to approach it in the first place. I mean, I'm generalizing, but that's how it is for me. How long does it take to make a video? And how much time average do you work on animations a day? Okay, I don't go by time basis, but a formula. It kind of explains my whack schedule. One day, I would dedicate to writing a script. The second, I would draw out the scenes according to what's on the script. And then wait until I can go home by the end of the week to record any lines. Editing is the longest and the most distracting process because you tend to watch the same scenes over and over again. Go for at least 30 seconds of the video each day. Can you draw anime? I can, but I won't. Actually here, I drew this masterpiece for you just now. Do you like Linkin Park? They made up my childhood. How can I not? How do you make animations? Animations where? What's your favorite meme? Terrible DeviantArt drawings. Why does your character look like they want to off themselves with a gun with those eye bags? Cause my voice sounds like that. But for real though, can you imagine if my character looked like this and had this voice? Cause I can't. What is your crown for? It's just part of the character design. No, I'm not trying to say I'm better than anyone just cause I have this three pointed spiky accessory on my head. If it makes anyone feel better, we're gonna make it clear now that this is just a paper crown. There we go. <laughs> what race are you? Funny thing is people try to guess where I'm from based on my voice. I've heard Hispanic, Greek, Italian, Slovak, Filipino, German, and many others. I'm actually Korean. Don't ask which one, because I fucking swear. Tabs, why do you have a bat? Originally, I wanted an axe, but that would add too much to the current edge people think I have. So behold, a bat. Give us a new fucking video. A few... Have you played or heard of Overwatch slash Undertale? Heard of? I can't escape it. It's everywhere. My last Q&A had a ton of questions referring Jeez. to Undertale, and it all just flew by my head. And played? No. What's your inspiration? My goals and everyone else work insanely for their goals. Help me draw. What drawing pad you use? I'll tell you this. You can only help yourself. You can have all the tools and tutorials, but it's worthless if you don't devote time practicing with them. I also use a Cintiq Intuos Pro for when I'm traveling or in the dorm. Doritos or Chitos? Hot flame and Cheetos. But you should have added Takis in there. And Takis for sure. Have you ever seen a Studio Ghibli film? Yep. 
Spirited Away, Ponyo, Howl's Moving Castle, Grave of the Fireflies, and The Secret World of Arieti. I wanna watch Princess Mononoke soon though. Two videos from tabs in a week? What is this witchcraft? Now if only I could do that every week. What's your favorite horror movie? Don't breathe. What age did you stop trick-or-treating? 15. But some people still think that's too old. Why can't you upload more? Exactly, why can't I? You always have that crazy look in your eyes. Are you insane? Nope, just woke. Are you the only artist in your family or not? As far as I know, yeah. Look at my brother's masterpiece. People <laughs> want him to replace my character with this one. I agree. What's your favorite game? This one was made a while ago, but Eve is a longtime favorite. I'm good at music. What are you good at other than art? I like music too. On my free time, I like to play electric guitar, bass guitar, acoustic guitar, and drums if I have access to it. I also enjoy aggressive sports. Answer waifu, I have my reasons. Will you do a face reveal? Please do. Sure, anything for you, my love. I already know some of you are gonna mention my voice doesn't fit my face. It's whatever. Can't really do anything about that. But without further ado, messy bedhead tabs, mono edgy tabs, alien tabs, and a bag of talkies. Enough versions of tabs for ya? Do you think that you could do like an old sketchbook tour? I'm a young artist and I'd like to see where you started off. Just like everyone else except prodigies, I started off drawing like crap. What's your favorite style slash type of art? Concept art all day. Concept sketches, concept everything. The creativity shows and the lines are always so fluid. Plus there are a lot of creature drawings to fit this genre. Oh my. Activity shows and the lines are always so fluid. Plus, there are a lot of creature drawings to fit this genre. How dank are ya, mate? Also, one R8 this video in 88 MLG. I don't know how to read. <laughs> Are you from the south? No, I ain't. You reckon you were darn tootin'? I'm just being stereotypical. I've always wanted to visit Texas, though. Do you I like am turtles? Texan. If so, what's your favorite kind? Yes, turtle amigo. Are you ever gonna play video games on another channel, or are you ever gonna do it? Playing video games sounds fun, but it upsets me long term, so no. If you can meet any other YouTuber, who would it be? P.S. Here's a cookie. Patrick, Fred, David, and Casey Neistat. Can you do a collaboration with somebody? If you already did it, can you send a link, please? I have a playlist with all the collaborations I did on my channel. Misha D on the Pokemon Go, but Cupcake gonna be pro to pro. You give me a hug. I'm an edgy teenager, and I've been told the only cure for this disease is adulthood, so I'm dead. No. Oh, you're just hoarding the questions, aren't you? Who's your favorite fictional character? Top from Avatar The Last Airbender. In the last Q&A you mentioned, you can play an instrument, so... Do you like burritos or tacos better? Oh, and can you play something? I don't see how playing an instrument correlates with burritos or tacos. Chipotle all day. If you were an ice cream, what flavor would you be? Chocolate, so I could eat myself. Do you draw in a sketchbook? <laughs> also, if you have to pick Jack Paul or Logan Paul, which one would you choose? Yes, I draw in many sketchbooks. I would choose Logan Paul. He seems to know how to stay out of trouble. I got a question. What tips do you have for teens, preteens who want to animate? But they are too poor to buy a tablet. Parents are also poor. Oh, I feel you on this. I've been through that myself. For the time being, develop your drawing skills with pencil and paper using the fundamentals and basics so that later on when you actually get the chance to work on animations, the process will be easier for you. Also study the programs with the tutorials provided on YouTube. And last but not least, to finish this off, I promised I would feature some Inktober pieces you guys did. Take some time to appreciate these if you can, cause it does look like a lot of time was spent on these pieces. Skilled or not, doesn't matter. So thank you to everyone who part- Look at Nini's tacky village. I know, it's so trashy. Trashy! I'll show you which- How many effing coins do they have? <laughs> okay. I got duct tape on my mouth in the thumbnail, but we're not going to be using that because that looks kinky. Instead, middle school me is going to be wearing a bandana to represent limited speech. Now imagine seeing this out of context. You'd think I was either, one, wearing a diaper on my face, two, trying to rob a bank, or three, join your friendly neighborhood gang. Trip, trip, trip. Anyways, towards the end of high school, you know how most college application essays require you to answer the question, what was the most significant change in your life? Or, what was your biggest obstacle and how did you overcome it? And here's the answer in short, puberty. Unless you want to be a smart ass and get rejected from all the colleges you applied to, there's your answer. 
But from what I remember, everybody I know, including their moms, wrote down the same exact thing. I used to be a quiet kid, but now I'm not. Real special, kid. These college admission officers are done reading the same cookie-cutter bullshit over and over again. Now hold up. I'm not trying to downplay anyone's struggle right now, but I'm just saying a bunch of us went through that same quiet phase ourselves. And your girl was one of these kids. Not exaggerating when I say I was mute to the point that nobody in my school, including my teachers, knew my voice. Cause I said nada. I know this ain't a contest or anything to brag about, but this for sure was one of my biggest regrets in life. But how'd you get through three years without talking in school? What? Right? Crazy. You tell me I was going to do YouTube back then and I would have thought, first of all, I don't trust anyone with vampire looking hands. And second, that's some bullshit right there. Like really, even starving artists would have been more believable. Years later, here we are. So as soon as middle school started, I don't know what in Fox's name came over my brain to come up with a thought as rational as, hey! Okay, okay, cool, nice. I got your attention. Listen, I have this grade A idea. Why don't we just get through middle school without talking at all? Make it clear to everyone that you hate them. I mean, have your own personal space. It's pure genius. Yeet, we yoloing up in this bitch. Yeah, okay, settle down. Now get out there and stay quiet for three years. You this bozo. is not for no, kids. No, of course it wasn't that simple. The actual reason I was so reserved was because... Well, let's just say there are some things going on back at home, but I'll spare you the details. All I want to say is that my household back then rarely allowed open discussions, and if you got close to trying, you might have gotten glass thrown your way. These events influenced my mindset enough to affect the way I interacted with everyone outside of home. But nothing to worry about since things are a lot more peaceful nowadays. On the first day of 6th grade and on 4th, I had nothing to say. Zero words to bring to the table and no interest ever in raising my hand. By the end of the first week, the kids in my class gave me some cool nicknames. The quiet one. The mute kid. She might be a serial killer. Never smiles. And who? But those tags stuck on to me for the whole three years, and it became real once I accepted those labels for myself. And for that reason, I basically went through middle school as a mime. Mr. Mime! Middle school and high school are the most memorable years of your life, they said. Middle school is gonna be so much fun, they said. High school are the golden years of your life. Shut up. Clearly whoever they is is a person of betrayal and lies. Of course, without talking, there isn't really an opening for you to make any friends in the first place. Yeah. There was also never really a- When you steal a drink from the fridge and your mom comes in your room. Leave a funny comment related to this video using the hashtag the meme sheep to be featured in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> Poor cat. Such a good fucking guy. <laughs> oh, I'm a good guy. It is easy being like this. What is autism? Autism is a neurodevelopmental disorder that is behaviorally described. The issue is in three areas being involved, which is your social communication. <laughs> <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha
disordered speech and language, not just delayed language, but disordered language or atypical language development. <laughs> oh, why did you? That is not funny. Wow. Yeah, he has autism. He has autism. Ha, 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 ha. 